Ladies and gentlemen, all the anticipation leads to this moment. Welcome to Extreme Rules. Coming to you live from Raleigh, North Carolina. We've got one of the best lineups in WWE history, so stay tuned. Don't change that channel. We have singles action coming up next. We have one of the best talents on the roster to date, taking on some tough competition. You don't want to miss it. Making his way to the ring from Raleigh, North Carolina, weighing in at 236 pounds, Sam Rex. Here we go. This is the match a lot of these people came to see tonight. And with good reason, Michael, this one's been brewing for quite some time. From where I sit, he certainly seems more focused than perhaps I've ever seen him. He's got one tall task ahead of him here, that's for sure. And his opponent, from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 230 pounds, Alan Young. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. It might go sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match. And on top of that, this match will undoubtedly have a big impact on where these guys stand in the next WWE.com power rankings. And there's been so much upward movement from new faces over the past few weeks that dropping more than 10 spots following a loss isn't necessarily out of the question. Time to get we've got trouble here guys looks like somebody came in tonight ultra motivated what a display of unmitigated strength here he goes face buster man that was vicious this might be it guys that should do it boy that was fast okay guys i want to talk a little bit about rex here 
You're the so-called expert, so what can we expect from him tonight? We the pain's too great. They tapped out. That's the match. Here is your winner, Alan Young. I don't know too many people that wouldn't have tapped out to that. There's few things more humiliating than tapping out to your opponent. I don't think anybody would have expected anything less from a match here at Extreme Rules. That was the absolute definition of vicious. Now, don't go anywhere. We have a classic coming up. We have one of our breakout talents against an imposing adversary. Going to settle the score. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 238 pounds, Terry Riley. Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting superstars ready to square off here. And there's nothing quite like seeing two superstars settling it in the ring in one-on-one -on -one action, Michael. I gotta say, guys, he doesn't appear to be in the mood here tonight. He's not the only one, Cole. I gotta say, I'm not really in the mood to be sitting next to you two, but... And his opponent, from Dallas, Texas, Weighing in at 225 pounds, Troy Mack. Two of WWE's top stars ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. Allow me to point out just how focused he appears to be here tonight. I noticed the same thing, Cole. In fact, it looks to me like he'll settle for nothing short of a victory here in this one. The superstars are ready, and so are we. Here we go. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. He's showing amazing agility here. Whoa! An impressive uppercut. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. Let's talk about Riley for a moment. What kind of attack, what kind of tactics are going to help him here tonight? I've been looking forward to these two competitors squaring off for quite some time now, Cole. And it's times like these where he just hopes he worked hard enough, long enough to get the victory here. He's playing with him now. He wants no part of this. He's in a bad way following that senton. Surprises him with that drop kick. He unloads an amazing series of moves. Not going to win many matches with that move. He has him right where he wants him. He'd be wise to stay right there. Flies through the air with a moonsault. The end may be near. There it is. He's looking good now, guys. Back now inside the ring.
putting it all on the line. He's looking at it. He landed it. Nobody does it quite like him. Yeah, and he goes for the pin. One, two, three. He's done it. Here is your winner, Terry Riley. A very decisive victory here tonight. I could watch them go at it each and every week. What a match. And listen to this rally crowd show their appreciation for such a great match. Now don't go anywhere. We have a classic coming up. We have one of the best talents on the roster to date versus a formidable opponent. Oh, I cannot wait. Making his way to the ring from Seattle, Washington, weighing in at 238 pounds, Gary Gibson. Here we go, and it sounds to me like the crowd is more than ready for this one. So am I, Michael. I've been looking forward to this match for a long, long time. And I'd also like to add that this match will go a long way in determining the pecking order here in WWE. Yeah, and he's hoping his stock continues to rise. A loss here, though, would certainly crush those hopes. And his opponent, from Edmond, Oklahoma, weighing in at 247 pounds, Danny Kent. Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting superstars ready to square off here. And there's nothing quite like seeing two superstars settling it in the ring in one-on-one -on -one action, Michael. I don't think I remember the last time he looked this motivated, guys. That's a scary thought, Cole. Even before tonight, I don't think I've seen too many superstars more motivated than him. Okay, guys, we're ready to get this one underway. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again.
Tell me your thoughts on Gibson. Tell us, what do you think we can anticipate seeing from him in this one? You know, I can't call this yet. What I can tell you is these competitors have that fire in their eyes tonight. This one is going to be great. I agree, and the crowd seems to be backing him here, so that always helps. Not going to win many matches with that move. And that chop finds its target. Caught by surprise by the breaker. Dropped by a clothesline. Gibson may be in trouble here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. I definitely admire his style in the ring, but as this match goes on, he has to remember that you don't get points for respect, meaning he might have to be a little more ruthless than usual if he wants to win this match. When this guy's on, look there! Big opportunity here. He's taking a long time to get up. Look at it, catch him off guard. One, two, three. This singles match has come to an end. Wow. Here is your winner, Danny Kent. Put it in the books. And there was no question about that one. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for the three count. And listen to this rally crowd show their appreciation for such a great match. The wait is over. This one's for all the marbles, and it's coming up next. We have Carl Anderson against an imposing adversary. The crowd is buzzing. Championship match on tap. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States Championship. Carl Anderson on his way down the aisle now. And there's no limits to what Carl Anderson can do inside that ring. I'd like to point out just how focused these guys look here tonight. They really do, Michael, which makes me think we're in for one heck of a match here tonight. Two of WWE's top stars ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. Guys, he enters this match sitting in the number four spot in the rankings. And while that's certainly something to be proud of, Cole, I can tell you he won't stop until he's at the absolute top of the mountain. That's just the kind of guy he is.
Introducing the challenger from Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 200 pounds, Roderick Strong. Introducing the champion from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 213 pounds, he is the United States champion, Carl Anderson. Ah, oh, yeah, it's go time. Okay, let's get this match going. Settle in, guys. This is going to be a blast to watch. Here we go. Raleigh sounds ready. And so are we. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. Well, the top of Carl Anderson here. Tell us your thoughts. It'll be interesting to see how he plans to get it done. What do you think? Speaking to his people, he was really optimistic about his chances, but from what I've seen so far, I'm not buying it. I agree, and the crowd seems to be backing him here, so that always helps. He slams him down with authority. Carl Anderson is making his presence known. Got it. Michael, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Again. Hey, it seems to be working for him. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. Rocket kick. But did he go boom? Rocket kick. Nobody does it quite like him. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Anderson, boom, with the cutter. There is no coming back from that one. He's calling for it. I don't think this is the right time for Carl Anderson to be showing off. Surprises him with that drop kick. And this has got to be it. One, two, three. The history books will have to wait another day. Here is your winner, and still the United States. Champion Carl Anderson. There's no doubt about it. That's a big pinfall win right there. Wow, when you pick up a pinfall victory over somebody like that, you've done something right. And listen to this rally crowd. Show their... Up next is the long-awaited championship match. We have one of our breakout talents against an imposing adversary. Don't miss it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship. All the way from Western Australia. Here comes Shane Thorne. Well, Michael, I gotta say, I really like his chances here tonight. 
And I'd add that he certainly has his work cut out for him here tonight. Would you agree, Byron? Yeah, this isn't going to be easy for him, that's for sure. But he knew that when he signed up for this match. Given the participants, this match might very well steal the show, guys. Yeah, and I think you could go so far as to say it has the makings of a match of the year candidate. Some are saying he's in the best shape of his career right now. Would you agree with that, Corey? It's hard not to agree with that statement, Cole. I mean, just look at him. I'll tell you, he's going to be tough to beat, that's for sure. Introducing the challenger from Perth, Western Australia, weighing in at 220 pounds, Shane Horn. Introducing the champion from Manhattan, New York, weighing in at 240 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, Keith Knight. Don't change that dial. This is it, fellas. We're ready to get this thing started. A bit of contempt coming through on that slam. That's one for the highlight reel. So much power behind that punch. Slam put him in a bad way, guys.
just making his presence felt there. Did you see that? Don't be surprised if you see that move trending worldwide on social media. Looks like Knight's starting to sweat here. Many see him as one of the greatest champions of this era. Tonight is his chance to prove it. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out. Oh, oh man, crushing clothesline. This might be the opportunity he needed. And if that doesn't elevate this rivalry, I don't know what will. No, he kicks out at two and a half. Just needs to do more damage. And that one grounds him. I didn't realize he had such a glass jaw. Exhaustion starting to set in for Knight. He's always ready for a fight and has seen his fair share of wars in WWE. Wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. Nobody home for that one. No kidding. There weren't even any lights on. Plenty of force behind that strike. His shoulders are down. And a kick out, much to nobody's surprise. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. There may be no stopping him. Oh boy, he is rolling. We've seen this before. DDT! He might have just ended this. Looking for the win. Oh, and there's a knee to the face. Looking at it here. Two, three. What a title defense. Here is your winner, and still WWE Champion, Keith Knight. A big singles victory here tonight. You know, it didn't happen often, but I can attest, being pinned is humiliating. I don't think anybody would have expected anything less from a match here at Extreme Rules. That was the absolute definition of vicious.